Hey, good afternoon, everybody. I wanted to stop today and talk about uh, some of the comments that I were getting in the comment box about uh, how long contracts normally take for it once you complete your training class. Um, you you may need to get, get in contact with your franchise owner. You may need to talk with them before you get started, before you before you sign a contract, before you get into the business. When you have your initial meeting with the with with the Jam Pro Master Franchise Owner, ask them roughly how long does it take for you know once I complete this training class, how long will it take for me to get my contracts? That way you'll have an understanding of how long it's going to take them, um, how fast how how fast is the market? You know if if the market is slow, then it's going to take him a little bit longer to get contracts. But if the market is booming, he may have contracts waiting on you. Um, upon completion. A lot of times, master franchise owners have contracts that they offer you while you're training. So it's important that you ask your master franchise owner, hey, what's the time frame on me getting contracts once I complete my five-week training course? Um, that way you'll know and, 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 and stay on them, you know. Call the operations specialist, call the de uh, the uh, the front desk um, the office manager and just ask them, Hey, you know, any word on me getting contracts, you know, let them know that you're eager to get started with the business. Um, normally when, when I sat down with our master franchise owner, we out of the gate told them that, you know, this is the type of, this is the type of income that we are looking to make with jam pro. We're looking to be full time. We're not looking for a part time gig. We're looking for a full time, um, business that I can, you know, dedicate all my time to. So in that, in that case, in that, when you let them know how serious you are about getting into the business, then they can move, um, accordingly. They can, they can set things up to where once you get started and you're, you're, you're doing well with your accounts, they can start funneling you more and more accounts. That way they can help fulfill your goals um, but you have to hold the master franchise owner accountable. You know, you have to call, you have to get those questions out of the way when you're sitting down with them in the initial meeting, you have to get those questions out of the way, because if you don't, they're not going to take you serious. They're not, they, they're going to just, they're going to give you contracts because you, they're thinking that you're trying to do it part time. So, um, Make sure that you're 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 talking to them with a sense of urgency and you're letting them know that hey, I'm looking to I'm looking to quit my job. I'm looking to do this full time. What can you do to help me get to that goal? And what can you do to help me build my business um so I can uh leave my job, my nine to five. But it's 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 gotta be up front. You have to go in to this this initial meeting with that mindset, you know. Um, it's important that you do that because one, it shows them that, you know, Hey, I have a, I have a business owner that's going to, that's going to, that's motivated. That's going to, um, go into this with his, uh, head down. He's going to do the work, the necessary work to be full time in this business. So it gives them a uh, opportunity to gauge your goals, your long-term goals, your 12 month goals, your five year goals. It gives them the opportunity to gauge that. And always, like I said, always hold them to the fire. You know, um, it's important that you do that because if you don't and you take the five week class and they sitting back and they it take you two or three months to get a contract, that's time lost. You know, you don't want to lose no time with this business. You want every day. You want every day to be working towards your freedom. Um, so. Definitely, when you sit down with your master franchise owner, make sure that you get those important questions out of the way. You know, how long is it going to take for you guys to fulfill my contract? How long is it going to take for me to continue to get contracts with you guys? That kind of stuff really matters. And that kind of stuff is really important for you. And as well as it, it helps the master franchise owner know exactly what you're trying to do. All right, guys, that's all I want to talk to you today about. Um, I'll be posting something else probably later on this week. Um, 
I'll definitely be posting on my VIP Patreon page. And and guys, my VIPs, please, if you have any questions, please, you should have my number. Give me a call or email me on the Patreon page so I can answer your questions. I can give you a phone call and go over some things. And also, when you start getting these contracts, you know, utilize me, you know, give me a call and say, hey, can we sit down and go over these contracts so we can make sure that they make sense? I'm I'm free to do that. You know, it doesn't bother me. And I love to help people, you know, get started. So give me a call. Uh, for my VIPs, please reach out to me. Um, you're not bothering me. Uh, reach out to me and say, hey, we need to talk so I can set up a time so I can give you a call. All right. Thanks. You have a great day.